the student undergrad and grad is the center of our activity. And that has forced us to rethink a lot of our strategies. It is the goal that led to rethinking the number of colleges. It is the goal that led to rethinking how do we build new institutes, uh, more academic infrastructure, more student housing. And then these goals were accelerated by the light rail coming to town. The time was right, uh, and we just had to go do something about it. UC San Diego right now is in the middle of what I think of as a physical, intellectual, and cultural transformation. Uh, my vision is that we will become primarily a residential campus. That does not mean everybody will stay on campus. It just means that everybody who wants to stay on campus for four years should have the ability to stay on campus. Uh, and this is both for undergraduates and graduate students. And this will be 20% below market, uh, clearly addressing the issue of cost of education, cost of research, depending on undergrad or grad. So I'm excited about uh, the North Torrey Pines Living and Learning Community. That is a 2,000-bed facility with two new academic buildings, one for arts and humanities and one for social sciences, with a craft center for the community. And I think that is the first step in the conversion of UC San Diego to a live, learn, play community. I'm also excited about building two new colleges. Uh, the seventh and the eighth college. This would give us the opportunity to define the next generation of general education. It would allow us to build infrastructure just like the North Torrey Pines Living and Learning, and it would incorporate shopping, uh, classrooms, and mixed mode multi-use spaces, and this would be the next step in our transformation. The connection with downtown San Diego does a couple of things for us. One is it makes our extension, UC San Diego extension, come closer to the main campus and its programs. Secondly, it connects the underserved part of uh, San Diego to UC San Diego and La Jolla through the trolley. And the vision we've been pursuing is building an innovation design hub which would offer courses to these underserved communities which would educate uh, incoming undergraduate students and prepare them for life and the program at UC San Diego. The campaign for UC San Diego is going to be impactful uh, for everybody. Uh, as I look at the community, we are in the midst of a significant uh, physical expansion of this campus. Uh, over the last five years, we've done $2 billion worth of construction, primarily in a few buildings. The next five years, seven years, we're going to spend more than $3 billion building 10,000 new houses, two new colleges to guarantee that there's no more than 4,000 per undergraduate college, uh, several new academic buildings. I'm happy to say and proud to say is resonating extremely well with our alumni and the community. And you can see that because we have raised $1.5 billion, 75% of our goal, in 50% of our time. So I'm excited about where we are headed. I tell people that I want each and every one of you to own a piece of UC San Diego. If you're an alum, I want you to own it uh, intellectually, physically, emotionally. I don't care any which way that you can help, you should. If you are a member of this community out here, I want you to own it. I want you to be a supporter because Without you, we would not be as great. And if I may say so, without us, this community would not be as thriving as it is right now. I think the best way to describe it would be you see socially dynamic. I think you would see a live, learn, play community out here. I think you would see a community that is yet one more destination in San Diego for a whole lot of art and culture. Uh, I think you will see a university which is one of the top five in the country. And I think you will see a university that is firmly grounded in San Diego and contributing very significantly to the economy and to the cultural life in this city. <music>